Hey, what's up guys? This is here again and sorry for not uploading. It's just I've been very busy with uni and some stuff, but I'll try to keep uploading once every week, so stay tuned. Anyway, today I'm reviewing the Bose Soundtouch 10. My friend bought it and he asked for my opinion, so here it comes. I'm going to look at three main aspects, design and portability, functionality, and of course, sound quality. So starting with the design and portability. As we know, Bose is always looking for the classy comfort look. Therefore, the speaker size is not big at all. In fact, the height is 21.2 centimeters and the width is 14.1 centimeters. And of course, it's not heavy at all and it weighs at 1.3 kilograms. So literally, you can put it in any backpack or traveling bag on the go. However, the only thing that this speaker lacks is a built-in battery. Basically, you need to plug it to a wall to enjoy your music. Like really, who would buy a small speaker and keep it plugged into a wall? I'm sure the only reason they bought it for because of the size and they can carry it to other places. The remote control design is fairly simple and it has that nice rubbery material on it so I like it. But that giant black bar on top for sending signal can't be unseen. It took the remote design back four years and not a modern style anymore. Now let's talk about functionality. The speaker supports wireless Bluetooth and AOX connectivity through your phone or your computer device. Obviously the easiest way for me to connect my stuff was through AOX port. When I tried the Bluetooth functionality on my phone, it was very slow and my friends actually connected fast. So it kind of didn't work for me, but worked for them. Another thing I really like about this speaker is the fact that you can save music or let's say like music using the like button on the controller. And what it does, it saves the songs in a kind of an array from one to six and then you can instantly access it later. But uh, what I don't actually like is they can only do six tracks or maybe it was more to our radio so six radio channels maybe however i don't really listen to radio finally the sound quality so here's a sample for you to listen to I could do this all day, I could do this all night, all month, all year for my whole entire life. Who you know got a home but seem to live on a road looking like a black Well, Bose, you really let me down this time. I'm a fan of your headphones and car speakers, but I don't think you're on point this time. For $200 or 170 UK pounds, this is a bad quality speakers. Yes, I can see where it's coming from though. You get all these functions with the remote and small size, but what is the point if the sound quality is not good enough? The bass is not there, the highs and the mids are mixing together, and yes, you can't equalize it unless you use an external equalizer. Finally guys, thanks for watching this video. In my opinion, it's a good speaker, but for the price tag, you can get something better, and I'll try to review something better soon. Make sure to subscribe if you enjoyed my video, I try to be creative and informative as much as I can. Follow me on Twitter, add me on Snapchat because I have a giveaway coming soon and a tech series of course. My name is Ziz and I'm walking through the valley of death, see you soon.